following up on my last video that I did reviewing the Logitech Brio 4K Pro Magnetic, that's I think the official word for it, the Magnetic um, webcam, I will post a link to it on the top right, but um, I found that you can actually blur the background. Now, you, you can do this not with the built-in Logitech app, which they call, um, I think, Logitune. Uh, you do need the Logitune to adjust certain things on the webcam, like saturation, uh, brightness, things like that, autofocus, you know, stuff like that, you know, also to update the firmware. But you can actually blur the background like this using the OBS app, which is the capture app that I use. It's also a streaming app. And uh, there is a filter that you can just download. I'm on a Mac, so I just download it. It's a zip file. Uh, and then install the package and it automatically installs the filter and then you go to the filters area for your source for the Logitech Brio in the OBS app and uh, it is called background and remove blur and then um, there's a little uh, a slider adjuster that you can adjust this let's see if I can do this on the fly so I think this back blur background looks pretty good it looks pretty natural as you turn it up you kind of see it gets more unnatural and even some of my top of my hat is getting blurred it's almost too much and you can turn it way up and then it just looks way natural i mean way unnatural um, but then you can turn it completely off and you kind of take the whole background out so it's kind of kind of finding that good balance uh, which i think is right about here uh, and i think it looks pretty good pretty natural you can also tweak the settings more advanced like too but i just have it kind of on the automatic blur setting and i think this looks pretty good so that is how to blur your background. After you install the filter, just go to the filters area on your source in the settings for the source, and you'll be able to find it. It's called, after you install it under effect filters, it's called background remove slash blur. And uh, you'll be able to find it that way. And again, it can blur the background. So, so anyway, this is the blurred background, and uh, I think it looks pretty good versus an unblurred background. See you in my next video.